we are going to have unique bodies in the near future in next 40 50 years we are going to be having unique bodies new kind of bodies whose brain size will be larger whose subtle grooves will be deeper the ability to understand and grasp the information will be more and who will also be higher genders who will have the freedom to play with multiple genders these new bodies are coming understand sadashiva has created yoga even for the bodies which are going to come in the future bodies which were there which are which will be he knows the whole and he has revealed yoga for the whole no one can develop on sada shiva you need to know very clearly there are three kind of people teaching yoga one who claims they are teaching from their personal experience second who knows only the scriptures teach only from scriptures does not have personal experience pandits scholars i tell you the pandits and scholars who just teach from the books without having personal experience cause less damage to people than the so called enlightened gurus who declare they are teaching from personal experience does not abide the sastras does not abide by the scriptures please understand this is one of the important revelation i am giving you these so called enlightened gurus who does not abide by the scriptures are more dangerous to human beings humanity than the people who are abiding just by the scriptures without enlightenment because people who are abiding just by the scripture without enlightenment cannot damage you they may not be able to give you experience but they can't damage you because they are just following the scripture scriptures can, will never damage you but the so called enlightened fellows who don't follow the scriptures because they get your complete trust and authority they became authority just by convincing you in some two three things blowing the nose and see when you do the hyperventilation naturally you will feel little peace and calmness that peace does not mean you have become enlightened or yes become enlightened pick up a cell phone and talk to your spouse you will see the strength of that peace understand the so called enlightened masters who do not abide by the scriptures are more dangerous than just the pandits parrots who repeat from the scriptures directly they are see the so called enlightened masters who don't follow the scriptures who don't abide by the original yogic literatures they get one or two glimpses here and there and by giving those one or two glimpses they convince the people and the people start following them they suddenly become authorities once they become authorities all the stupidity they vomit you will be following they can seriously damage your body mind and consciousness very rare are the third varieties third category of teachers who have a solid personal enlightenment experience who are authorities responsible for what they are speaking and completely connected rooted centered on the traditional yogic scriptures 
those are the rare beings from whom you should learn people who claim they had a personal revelation experience it may be sometime good for them but there is no guarantee it is good for all of you what is good for all of you it should be the personal realization of your guru and directly in tune with the original scriptures only then it should be shared with the world it is worthy of being shared with the world when you choose your guru first option the best thing is find a person who is enlightened experience who can play with energy who can directly transmit experience to you and who is in tune with the original shastras i may have 10000 experiences atma pramana but whatever is in tune with the apta pramana the original scriptures revelations by sadashiva only those things are worthy of teaching to all the human beings only those things will become sakshi pramana for all of you for the whole world so an important truth you need to know no one can develop on sada shiva do not go to people if they claim they developed they developed no don't become prey to the marketing gimmicks an immature ego of some of those great marketers a great advertisers marketing and advertising is a different capacity the original knowledge source being the reliable knowledge source is different popularity does not mean that's not necessarily guarantee quality so do not be cheated you yourself dig out investigate whether what i am being taught is in alignment with the original shastras with the original scriptures with all the joy and pride i declare everything i am teaching is my personal experience atma pramana and completely in tune with apta pramana the original scriptures and original revelations from the tradition